Hey YouTube, I am Leo with dualsim.us and I want to make this quick video about the Ecobee thermostat and the companion app. And uh, basically I've been using Ecobee for about six months. It's a smart thermostat and I've had an Android app installed for a while. Uh, it, it's been a crappy app all along, but in January they've made an update that completely disabled my app and it's super pissed me off that's why i'm making this video to let people know about this garbage going on and uh you know to warn against buying it at this point because their app is broken and you basically cannot use the smart thermostat features of it which is controlling your thermostat from on the go and stuff like that so um on january 26th they made an update when you launch the ecobee app you get this garbage message about some secure credentials now again the app was working before it wasn't working well like uh it was slow it took me five seven attempts to change the temperature never mind trying to set up schedule but at least i could do it on the go now i cannot do it at all because the app won't start so i left a very unpleasant comment on the app and uh if we look at comments everybody is complaining about it like this guy francisco Francios, France, whatever. Ah, uh, he says security credential bullshit. Same here, you know. Uh, this guy also same problem. And uh, basic functions work. Basically, a lot of very recent review, bad reviews, and it's been a month almost. Ecobee still have not made any changes. They completely ignore their users who pay 250 bucks for this thermostat. You know they. We gave Ecobee our vote of confidence versus Nest. We could have gone with Google. We went with Ecobee, you know, trying to support the smaller guy. And this is how they uh, bend us over. Very unhappy. So what I did, I actually went to my, uh, my the only Android blog that I read, Android Police. Um, the reason I read it, I used to read Android Central, but their website is so overloaded with crap ads like my i7 macbook would just completely choke on their website and i i said enough and is enough that site is garbage so now i read android police pretty good news great deal updates but uh, basically i submitted the tip to their website um so you can see thanks leo <laughs> that's me and uh they uh, uh they wrote about this crap going on with ecobee now you can read this article it's from February 17th, today is like February 20th, or something like that. And uh, so this guy from um, from Ecobee, this guy Mike, he leaves a comment stating some, uh, some nonsense <clears throat> about security credentials. But basically, if your phone is rooted or uh, you have a custom ROM, you cannot use the app. It's complete garbage. First of all, my phone is not rooted. Uh, here's the root checker and uh, verify root no root it's stuck uh, you know Android version on this blue pure Excel and again this app used to work uh, and it stopped working after the January 26th update the phone is not rooted so I don't know why the hell this is going on but basically this guy Mike is tell, tells me this bullshit like they're trying to protect me with this security thing. So I can't... This is my phone, Mike. I have the right to root it or unroot it or do whatever the hell I want with it. I bought the phone. I bought your damn thermostat for 250 bucks. And your app sucked to begin with. And now you completely kill my access. So, guys, if you're thinking about an Ecobee thermostat, don't buy it. Go with the Nest, go with something cheaper, you know, Wi-Fi thermostat. Actually, all the smart features, really, I don't really use them. Uh, the only usable feature on it is the ability to turn off and to turn on heat or AC when you're not home, so you don't waste energy. Um, now, if you have, you know, a 9 to 5 schedule, and uh, then the scheduling works, but you can go with like a $70 Honeywell smart thermostat, and do the scheduling by yourself or you can pay like 130 bucks for Honeywell Wi-Fi thermostat and be able to change uh, the temperature remotely. You don't need to pay 250 bucks to get a crappy app from Ecobee and then being cut off completely. So very unhappy, Mike, Ecobee team, 
I like the thermostat. Your Android app sucked all along. It was super slow, super buggy. But fix this goddamn thing. I'm very unhappy. I will tell everybody not to get Ecobee because you guys do this crap. Uh, this thermostat has been out for over a year. You had a chance to make your Android app work long ago. And instead, you just completely cut a lot of people off. And uh, you completely ignore user comments on your app on Google Play. See how many recent one and two star comments you get. All about the same issue. You completely ignore it. It's been almost a month. There is no update. And then when I submit my tip to an Android blog that gets some readership, your guy Mike comes over and feeds some nonsense bullshit about... You know, trying to protect the consumer. This is garbage. Get your shit together, fix it. And uh, if you're if you're a consumer considering it could be, don't get it. Go with Nest. Get like a Honeywell, you know, Wi-Fi thermostat. Don't get an it could be, especially if you have Android and are rooted or consider root. It's not gonna work, and uh, it's gonna be very painless. You lose the ability to use the smart thermostat feature. All right, I've been uh, ram rambling about this long enough. Thank you for watching, guys. Please like this video if you enjoyed it. Share it. Let other people know about this nonsense going on. And uh, uh, subscribe to my channel. Uh, if you have any questions or thoughts or comments, leave them in the comment section below. I'll see you in the next video. Peace.